folks! Hey you! It's so great to see you again. Welcome back. Come on, get comfortable. Sit in. I'm about to show you something today. Do you also have a heaping amount of special butter? And have you thought to yourself, what can I do with all this an enormous amount of butter that I have? Maybe you're sick of making cookies. I know I am. <laughs> Long story short, I had some special dust. That sounds illegal. It's not. <laughs> That's not what I meant. But I wanted to make my own edibles for my birthday because I've never really like, I've had them a few times in the past, but nothing like, not an enormous amount of them. I've only ever had like one. And I don't think that they ever really did anything for me. I see people online all the time. They're like zooted out of their minds. I don't know how, I don't know why. I made a batch for my birthday. They were okay. I don't think they did a whole lot. I think it was more of a body though than a head. And that's why I didn't notice it as much, but I, I did feel very comfortable the whole time. I'll say that. But I had two grams, which means I have an enormous amount left. So what are we doing today? I'm going to make some French toast. Maybe you're sick of your boring morning routine. You get up every morning, make yourself some French toast and go, hmm, that's good, but it could be better. I'm going to show you how to make it better. I don't know what I'm doing though. I've never done this before. I don't know if I'm going to do this right. Um, I'm just going to use the butter as I would normal butter, put it in the pan, cook some French toast on top of it. We're going to see how it tastes. We're gonna see if it's worth it. Was this a waste of butter? Who knows? Come along. I don't know how I feel about this angle. What's it looking like up there? How's the weather? So I got a pan, we got the butter, we got the eggs, I got a cup of milk. But my main purpose for doing this is I have an antibiotic to take and I cannot take it on an empty stomach or it makes my tummy upset. So I thought, why not use the butter and the French toast together and then I get a meal and everybody wins, yeah? With our two eggs in the bowl, we're gonna add half a cup of milk. Just a little splash of it. Then I'm gonna add just a cap's worth of vanilla here and just add that in. You can use as much vanilla as your little heart desires though. I might even do a tad bit. Not too much, here we go. That'll be tasty. One time I added too much vanilla to something, and it came out like horrible, and I was like, how the fuck can you add too much vanilla to something? How is that, how is that possible? We're gonna do a little bit of ground cinnamon here, sprinkle some of this into the mixture. To top it all off, which I'm gonna top the French toast with this when it's done anyways, but I'm gonna add it to the mixture as well, and this is Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cinnamon Dust. This stuff's really good, actually. I put it in my coffee all the time with some whipped cream. Oh. All right, let's get this mixed. Well, here's the butter. Like I said, I had an enormous amount of it. And this isn't even all, I've used some already, like I said, for my birthday. So this wasn't even all of it, but this is what's left. So I'm gonna use a little bit of this. Uh, I wanna save a little bit because there's some other stuff that I wanna try out. Um, I do wanna make another batch of something else, but I think a little bit of this off the big block should be okay, putting into the pan. So let's get this done. Cause I've had it for like, I don't know, my birthday was on like the 19th and I don't know how long it stays good for a store. So I want to get it like kind of gone before it's a waste. Cause then I'll be really mad. Dip my bread in, squish, 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 flip. Squish, 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 squish. It's hot enough, no! Little baby man, I a baby. Oh, this is making me mad already. This was not hot enough. Everything I touch fucks up and I'm sick and tired. Should I flip? Let's give it a flip. Oh my lord. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Why did it rip like that? Fuck off. First one's just a test run, baby. Always is, always will be. The second one coming out though, prepare yourself. Good butter. And take this one out and then I will throw my second one in and we'll see how it comes out. Are you excited? You should be. Oh no, 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 ah! Wonderful. Wonderful. Huh? Fuck it. Hot dog 
Tacos and hamburgers. We're gonna try out our French toast, see how we did on it. Lately I sucked at cooking. Yeah. <laughs> yep, that's infused. <laughs> Immediately taste it. Immediately taste it. It tastes just like the cookies I made with that little aftertaste of it. And it tastes the same way that the butter smells when opening the container. It tastes exactly the way it smells. Which isn't bad. I remember when I was eating the cookies, um, I didn't care too much for the aftertaste of it. Eventually I got used to it and it wasn't like too big of a deal. It was like, eh, whatever. Like second piece come out so much better. Second piece doesn't taste as intense as the first one. I mean that first one tastes like straight butter. It's intense. It's really intense. The second piece um, didn't get hit as bad, I guess. It does not have as strong as a flavor as the first piece that went into the pan. The good news is I can now take my antibiotic on a full tum tum. So no tummy aches here for me. Uh, I'm gonna finish some of this. Try to get most of it in, we'll see. And I will let you know in a little bit if I feel any different. I'll give it like an hour or something to kick in. We'll see if it did anything at all. <coughs> Hi, hello, it's me. I just got done filming my last video. It occurred to me I did not film the end of this video uh, for French Toast. So my conclusion, it was nothing special. I didn't feel really no different. I sat down and if you saw me revamp that five below table, I was working on that at the time. So I painted that and was like really into it and really focused for a minute. So if that counts for anything. But yeah, once again, I just feel comfortable. Um, they don't affect me like that. So I mean, if they affect you like that and you would like to have some French toast, highly recommend it. It does have a taste. If you're not into that, I don't know if there's something you could do. Maybe add some more vanilla. I did that to cookies the other day. And uh, it was really nice, actually. Comment down below if that's something you would try, if you would infuse your French toast, or if you would just rather not. Let me know, I'm interested. Also, give today's video a thumbs up, a little like, so that we know we're doing a good job over here. And thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate you. Take care, and I will see you in the next one.